Hi out there in s and land. Hey, welcome to another weekly update. This week I'm going to take you on a little field trip. So uh, we're going to turn off the camera and go inside of a store and check out and see what's going on. So uh, we'll be right back with you in just a second. Thanks. Bye-bye. Hey guys, here we are. We're inside the big box store, the Home Depot. wanted to draw your attention to some new promotion they're running, and it's right here. For $397 to install a whole house of laminate, basically. Now, as you know, um, or may not know, there's going to be additional charges and things like that um, that I'll get into in the second, second half of the video. Um, but I did want to point to this right here. This is their underlayment that they use. It's got like the little white bumps that really kind of fall off. So I wanted to show you that, and I wanted to show you the, the 397 for the full house laminate install. Now I'm going to go back outside and we'll shoot the rest of the video, okay? So just be aware and then we'll kind of go into that with a little bit more discussion and some of the stories that I've already heard about, it. okay? So we'll be right back, in, or right back to you in just a moment. Hi, welcome back. Hey, I just wanted you guys to see what the Home Depot, what their new promotion is about the laminate for $397, just so you're not caught off guard. Now we've already had a couple customers come into the different stores up here in the north with uh, the promotion. And the few things that we've learned, A, that obviously it's not quite what it seems, uh, and let me go over that. First off, it's only on special order material. It's none of their stock products, so their special order products are all a little bit more expensive. Secondly, a customer told us that they had three different freight charges, believe it or not. The first freight charge was because it's a special order. The second freight charge was from the store to her house. And then the third or additional freight charge, because she was considering doing an upstairs room, there's an additional charge for the installers to carry it upstairs. So uh, long story short, we ended up being less money on the total job package. Uh, I heard another one um, out of the Rockland store where the, um, the extras, such as the extra moldings and things like that, and we got real close in price just at our regular uh, listed pricing without any of the promotions. So the moral to the story, which it is with every job, we need to get into the customer's house. Okay, uh, Here at S&G, as you know, we like to give someone an accurate and fair price, uh, meaning that they're, we're pretty close when we go out and measure to what it's really going to cost. Some of the stores do the other thing. They shoot a real low per square foot price and then they do all the extras or add-ons. In fact, um, Pat Swank out of the Elk Grove store was telling me that every time that he measures against the Home Depot, he estimates for somewhere between 7 to 10 percent less footage. Okay, so obviously there's a lot of different games that a lot of different stores play with add-ons, extra footage, and things like that that we don't do. So what I want you to remember is always focus on the bottom line price, not the square foot price. And always talk to customer and, and tell them the benefit of letting S&G come out and do the free estimate. Okay? We had talked about that a number of months ago, how the more estimates we set up, the more business we write. And this is just another example of it where Home Depot looks like they have a cheaper price per square foot, but in actuality, we can compete with them every day. So keep up the good work. Keep setting up lots of estimates. Use your promotion codes to help close orders. And um, keep working hard. We appreciate it. Take care, and we'll talk to you next week. Bye-bye.